when it was diagnosed that I had um, might have a hernia uh, and uh, they referred me to a general surgeon and when I saw the list there were several on there that I knew and, and knew would do a great job but when I saw JJ or Dr. John Tabor I, I kind of jumped at the chance because I knew I knew that I had nothing to worry about with him. So a colleague called me and uh, he said, hey, Coach Cole needs uh, an operation and uh, he wants you to do it. And I said, and, and, and I was just floored to, to know that one of my previous mentors and coaches and teachers would consider me for, uh, to be his surgeon. I know Coach Cole from back in uh, high school, actually, uh, eighth grade. Uh, he was my uh, first PE teacher and then he was our track coach. He could have done anything. He could high jump, uh, he could uh, high jump, he could run, uh, sprints. Uh, but m my particular area of expertise was a javelin, and he was, I was sort of licking my chops when he came up through the ranks. Yeah, I was pretty good. Uh, I think I once, uh, I was a state champion uh, a few years, and I went on to throw at LSU for a little while. I, I kind of, I hurt my shoulder uh, the first year of college throwing the javelin, and it was either have surgery uh, and continue to throw the javelin, or just continue with college and, and my career, and I decided to continue with college and my career. I had no doubt that whatever he uh, gave his time and talents to, he was going to be exceptional. Somebody said, how does it feel to have one of your former athletes cutting on you? And I said, I'm, said, I'm completely at ease because JJ was a, a great student. He was a great athlete. He comes from a wonderful family. And I knew that I would be in good hands and he would take good care of me. You know, it, it was like not much had changed, uh, you know, we, we still had our same relationship, our same yeah. bond that we've had um, always and um, it's, you know, this is, this is someone you know personally, this is someone you grew up with and uh, you know, I, want, I want everything to go perfect on every patient but this, it just it put, puts more pressure on me as a surgeon um, and uh, thankfully the things went um, smoothly. Uh, seeing your former students and, and seeing them achieve things, whether it's just be uh, uh, professionally uh, with their families, you know, in the community, things like that, it it's, uh, makes, makes you, gives you kind of a warm feeling that uh, you feel good that maybe <clears throat> I didn't contribute to his success, but I had a part in seeing, seeing him advance and how far he had come and what a great job he's doing.